From the perspective of the customer, they're trying to answer a scientific question. They're operating within the confines of a, of a limited amount of money. They need multiple technologies to be able to do that. And that's where the arrays can really support them. NGS, or next generation sequencing, is fantastic for discovery, but a lot of our customers, especially pharmacogenomics customers, know exactly what they want to screen for. So arrays are perfect. The reliability, the simplicity, the ease of workflow and um, analysis, and also the affordability are essential for them and exactly what they're looking for. These customers are trying to process thousands or even millions of samples. And if you can do that on fewer scanners with less hands-on time, then you're really increasing your efficiency, lowering costs. The fact that we have so many samples and that volume, and the fact that we need that quick turnaround time that our, that our customers are asking for is something that we really need to be sure that we're enabling. And arrays allow us to do that. There's a lot of different use cases for arrays that kind of demonstrate that they're a really powerful tool. My customers has choose Infinium technology because it's a simple workflow. Illumina's new array portfolio has really increased the flexible options it has for labs to use, and especially within some of our direct-to-consumer customers. We have arrays that enable researchers that are doing everything from carrier screening to cytogenomics to pharmacogenomics to even agrogenomics. We can produce arrays that are fully customizable. We have multi-species arrays available. We're working on innovations like having a cloud-based platform where users can come and do multiple different types of analysis. So we're really taking that data that they have and making it more useful so they can get more insights from that same set of data. And that is just a clear advantage that we have uh, with our array technologies, that, that flexibility to take discovery from a lab and really deploy it on a, on a global scale. These arrays, given the cost effectiveness, given the ease of use, the fact that many of them are end-to-end, -end, from putting in DNA to having an, an interpretation and a result, that is enabling people to be able to show the value of precision medicine and to be able to get the support from their institutions to enable things to get done.